Hello everyone and welcome to my Bachelorette official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Helping other people. Lone Wolf Country fans got to know Thomas and Diane on Jen Tran's time of The Unhitched Female. After his experience on the show, Thomas has been keeping fans refreshed with his life via web-based entertainment. This week he focused on his excursion with emotional well-being and shared his story in another video to pay tribute to World Psychological Well-Being Day. In the video, he defenselessly shares, as a battled individuals with psychological wellness previously, something I've become exceptionally enthusiastic about. I'll share somewhat speedy, Cliff's Notes rendition about my set of experiences with psychological wellness. I lost my sister at an extremely youthful age just before Christmas, and it's sort of shaken my loved ones. That is one of the large things that's sort of driven me toward being a promoter for emotional wellness. He shared, I quit swimming really suddenly, that game that I accomplished for a very long time. I tied such a great deal my identity personally and my character to this game. Thus to lose that fundamentally short term was something that likewise sort of impacted my emotional well-being. Thomas then, at that point, drilled down into how going to treatment and connecting with everyone around him has helped him during troublesome times. He exhorted, assuming that you're battling and you're having a difficult time, contact individuals that are around you. I guarantee you that individuals are surprisingly ready to tune in. You might think, hello, nobody truly thinks often about my concerns. However, I guarantee you individuals that are around you, individuals that consideration about you, they do. Thomas proceeded, I've been honored to have an emotionally supportive network of loved ones that in the event that I asked them that I wanted them, they would drop anything they were doing and be their ASAP to take care of me. In the event that you feel awkward conversing with your companions about it, contact an expert, a specialist, and get some expert help. As an emotional well-being advocate, Thomas shared that it is so vital to monitor individuals and the amount it can help those going through a difficult time. He shared, assuming you realize somebody who's going through a hard time, simply message them, hello, contemplating you, Hello, you want to get something to eat? Hello, you want to come over and watch the game? That's what things like. It accomplishes such a great deal for that individual as somebody who was that individual. It accomplishes such a great deal for them, more than you could at any point think, simply that registration. Thomas additionally addressed how he desires to dispose of the shame around psychological well-being and looking for help. I've been going to treatment now for around eight years and I feel increasingly more on top of how to deal with specific circumstances, he shared, so I'm a tremendous supporter for finding support. Furthermore, I'm a colossal promoter of it's okay to not be okay. Thomas then, at that point, completed his video with a significant wake-up call for his devotees. He said, text somebody that you care about, tell them hey, monitor everyone around you that are battling. Furthermore, assuming you're battling, connect with somebody that you hold near you, and in the event that you don't have anybody, you have me. Give me a DM. I'm glad to listen closely or help you any way I can. Close by his video, Thomas additionally expressed, it improves soon. You don't need to do it without anyone else. Contact individuals around you, have beauty with outsiders cause no one can tell what they're going through. And it's not help, frail to concur. Help. We value Thomas for being so helpless and sharing his tale about his psychological well-being venture. We realize it will help so many others. Lone Ranger Country is sending our affection and backing to anybody who's battling. You are in good company opening up. Lone Wolf Country experienced passionate feelings for Daisy Kent as she searched for adoration with Joey Graziade on season 28 of The Unhitched Male. Since her experience on the show, 
Daisy has been sharing her life via virtual entertainment, frequently posting about occasions, travel undertakings, and her involvement in hearing misfortune. As of late, the unhitched male country star opened up and shared a few exhortations on, on pressure the executives and exploring sensations of dejection during an Instagram back and forth discussion. At the point when asked how she handles tension and stress with continually being occupied, Daisy shared that everything really revolves around viewpoint. She said, at the present time it recharges me. I get so energized, particularly when I get to do things as I did yesterday, speaking at LSU. I'm fortunate that I in every case ordinarily get to have somebody with me, which helps a ton. I continue a ton of strolls and ensure when I really want a breather to rest. Daisy likewise shared, I likewise recollect when I was wiped out and gone through months in the emergency clinic. A piece of it is I understand what it's prefer to be not beneficial and not ready to get up, so I'm simply so keen to being solid and having the option to be occupied. One fan requested how the unhitched male country star explores sentiments from dejection, particularly sincerely, while in school. Daisy answered, school is your most memorable time being away from home and sorting things out all alone for many individuals. I recall it could feel so forlorn now and again. I would approach young ladies and be so frightened to present myself, yet that is the means by which I met the absolute best individuals. She proceeded, work towards something you want to do, put forth an objective only for yourself. It's cool to take a gander at something and be as, that's what I did. What's more, I didn't require approval from anybody to do it. Daisy supported her adherence, saying, around 50% of my companions had views in school and the other half were single. Both are perfect, yet regardless of what it's so critical to do things yo you low v and invest energy dealing with yourself. You will change such a great amount in these four years and advance to such an extent. One more fan requested exhortation on tracking down their motivation or calling, and Daisy addressed that it's a work underway. She shared, nobody has it totally sorted out. I would take some time and record how you like to help fun. For me, it was things like composition, perusing, music, then taking a gander at things you might actually do. What about existence is it's never beyond any good time to change your way or have a go at something new. And one supporter asked Daisy how she gets herself and pushes forward when she feels like she's not doing what's necessary. Daisy replied, innovativeness generally helps me, it powers me. On the off chance that I'm feeling down or like I'm not doing what's necessary, I attempt to make something. Whether that is a TikTok or composing, it truly assists me with escaping a funk. Additionally, making sure to be caring to myself. Nobody has everything in perfect order and everybody has days they don't feel the best or even seasons that are like, what is happening? She added, some of the time you simply need to take it each day in turn and realize tomorrow will be better. Accomplish something you're enthusiastic about or compose slash doodle your contemplations. I additionally love to do this. We value Daisy's recommendation and realize that her proceeding to share her story and be so open about her encounters will help so many others. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.